The research that we've done and that I've been particularly involved in uh, studied the consequences of tree cover loss on the uh, urban heat island. And so the urban heat island is the concept of uh, cities that are appreciably warmer than rural or forested areas because of the presence of brick and asphalt and concrete. So during the day they absorb a lot of the heat and then release it in the afternoon. So cities are always much, much warmer in the, in the late afternoon. And in many places uh, throughout the world, urban heat island is a, a huge issue for human health and comfort. So what we found in locations that had uh, up to 40 to 50% tree removal due to host removal of, uh, for longhorn beetle eradication, the temperatures increased by uh, 30 to 40 percent compared to before uh, uh, the tree removal. And that gives a great uh, case uh, point to show that um, trees buffer uh, the urban heat island effect very, very effectively. So in a sense, if the tree removal hadn't been done, we wouldn't actually know uh, directly the benefit of trees. There have been studies done in other countries but you've never had this type of massive tree removal uh, in one place. So it's been very very dramatic. We studied that uh, the temperatures using satellite imagery and thermal satellite imagery and also sensors uh, that we put in place as well. So as it relates to uh, human comfort and uh, energy usage they're, they're all tied together. Um, so what we've learned is that shade trees are really the important uh, tree, type of tree that will provide shading for homes and for um, asphalt and for concrete. And an important part about this is that the placement and number of trees is very, very important. Uh, a one-for-one -one replacement isn't really sufficient. In other words, if you have one square of asphalt replaced by one tree, uh, the effects of asphalt and concrete uh, is still present. So you need twice as many trees as there would be a per unit area of uh, urban heat island materials. So more trees are always needed, particularly shade trees, to have this mitigating uh, effect. And we know that again from the tree removal that occurred. We know exactly when you remove X number of trees you have X amount of or why amount of urban heat island warming.